Well, if you're a sports fan, there wasn't much not to like about Sunday's pair of games between the Tigers and the Cajuns. A late inning rally win in game one, followed by a controversial and emotional ending to game two, proved Louisiana was very much up for the challenge of Championship Sunday. I thought they come out today and did what they needed to do the first game to get it extended. In game two, I was really proud of the kids. I thought we battled so hard. And again, we come from behind, got it tied 1-1. <coughs> I thought we made a great play, obviously, at the plate. And, you know, I'm 50 feet away, and I know I can't see it better than the, the guy six feet away. Anyone in the world will go back and watch that on replay. They'll know exactly what the right call was. There was no question. I think today um, showed today showed our fight for sure. Um, I don't think anybody was expecting us to even get this far and to end up where we were at. It was a pretty good feeling. Um, this this team was something special. They were all very young, but they're so talented. They don't even understand how talented they are. But being able to have that like fight and that heart is what made the game fun. And the conclusion of today's game also marked the conclusion of Jerry Glasgow's first season as Cajun's head softball coach. After the game, Glasgow thanked his team, saying, quote, I can't say enough about that. For them to take me to a regional championship and play the way they did today, I'll always be indebted to those girls. At Tiger Park, Mike Carter, KATC Sports.